Okay, hello Taurus, how you doing? This is Momo, I'm doing you guys Oracle reading. I will do your regular readings later, but this is a little something to hold you guys. Um, I hope you get some clarity you need from this reading, this Oracle reading. Like, share, hit the notification button to be notified when I post a video. New viewers, subscribe. Thank you for stopping by checking out my channel. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the reading, okay? So let's get into it. Okay, um, Taurus's energy, please. Tell me what, what you have for Taurus's energy. Tell me what you have for Taurus's energy. Okay, so so far. So we have unfinished symphony. So um, somebody wants to end some type of cycle and have a new beginning with you, or there's a cycle in your life that's ending, and you're going to have a great new beginning. Poised, maybe you've been waiting patiently for this to happen or trying to be patient in this situation is finally coming for you, you know, mending. Okay. This could be somebody, um, wanting to mend things with you, work things out with you. Okay. Or this is a new beginning for you where things are going to come together for you, you know, where things were rocky in your past, where now things are going to be coming together. Things are just going to be moved smoothly, like smooth waters for you, you know, um, between worlds here. Okay. Um, you could have been in a situation where you were in the dark, um, energy where things just weren't going right in your life. You were off balance. You may have off balance in your life where you're going to have total balance. Okay. You're no longer going to be in the dark. It's going to be all positive energy, all greatness ahead for you. Thinker is here. Um, this is a situation where, um, you need to use your intuition, um, use your wisdom to help you in this situation moving forward. Okay. Because you're very smart. Use your wisdom. Um, think before you um, take action on a situation. Put a lot of thought in it, into it before you take action, okay? Um, yeah, because there's nothing but positivity here, you know? Yin energy. Um, positive energy. Okay, um, there could be a situation where there's somebody who is your opposite. So you need to think before you move forward with this person. Okay, um, in this new beginning. Because they're your opposite or, you know, there's no need to rush into the situation. Okay, just make sure it's right for you. You know, make sure, you know, their energy, make sure their energy is on level with yours. Pretty much, like, make sure they're in the light. If you're in the light, make sure this person's in the light. You know, maybe there's some things you need to see concerning this person. Okay, who's coming in and wanting this new beginning with you. Um, but if you're not with anybody, if this is just a great new beginning, you're starting a new beginning of your life where it's all positive, no negativity. Yeah, you know, keep things light, keep things positive. Stay on balance. Um, no peace like home. I mean, no place like home. I'm sorry. Okay, so there's a situation. If this is somebody coming in to you at this new beginning, you're like home to this person. They're very comfortable with you. All right? Keep your space positive on this new beginning. If you're by your, on a journey by yourself in a new beginning where you ended a cycle with someone, you're embarking on a new beginning on, on your own. Keep it, keep it positive. Keep positive people around you um, so you will have comfort in your life always, you know. Don't invite negativity in your home, okay. Keep it light, keep it positive, you know. Okay, be careful who you bring around you, in other words, who you deal with, who you bring in your energy space because it's positive right now. Truth be told. Okay, so there's some truth coming out. Some truth coming out to you guys. So something's going to be illuminated to you where somebody's going to come out expressing the truth. 
Okay, and this could be from somebody that loves you. Or this person you're embarking on this new beginning with, they're going to express how much they love you. Maybe they never expressed this, but you're going to, truth be told, they're going to tell some truths because they love you. You know, they could be coming out expressing everything that you need to know because they love you. Okay. Community is here. Okay. Yes. This is somebody that wants a family foundation with you or. Yeah. So they know they have to be truthful with you, you know, be open with you about some things. Message in a bottle. So somebody is coming in with a message, some communication. So you're going to find out some truth. That's what I'm seeing here. I mean, you're going to find out some truth from somebody. It could be somebody at a distance from you. Somebody could be coming to visit you. Somebody could be moving to your area. Somebody who wants a family foundation with you. Um, clean it up. Somebody that went through a change, a major change. This person's coming in no longer how they used to be. They're coming in a new person. Yeah, they had a lot of dark energy. They were very toxic. Yeah, they healed from that. So this is somebody coming in very changed. Um, wanting a reconciliation. Somebody's wanting to reconcile. Taurus is energy. Taurus is energy. Could be a Scorpio. Never any story. Okay. So this is a never ending story. This person could have took you through a lot. Nothing might. This person may come in and acting like they changed. They may not have changed, of course. So be careful because this is a never ending story. Or something may not have changed. They may appear to be changed, but they may not have changed. They may take you through the same thing they have took you through in the past if you went through some things with this person. Flexible. Use your intuition. Be open-minded. You know. Yeah, because this person going to take you through the same cycles. Okay. Um. So use your intuition. Be very alert dealing with this person. Soulmate is here. Um, they do love you. This person does love you. They do see you as their soulmate. So maybe you need to open up maybe to this person. Um, maybe this is how you're going to feel. Maybe you don't trust this person. You don't think they change. But um, have an open mind. You know, try to open up to this person because they do love you. They, this is your soulmate. They, they may have work to heal. Okay, my bad on that. This person has cleaned themselves up. They have healed from a toxic energy, you know. But you may not trust it. Because they took you through so much. You kept going through the same thing over with this person for so long, maybe. Yeah, maybe a long time. You know, it took this person too long to change, maybe. But, you know, try to have an open mind. Try to open up to this person a little bit. Give them, give them a chance. Give this person a chance because this is your soulmate. They do love you. That's what I'm seeing here. Yeah. There you go. Source is energy. Um, Taurus's energy. Let's see what else we have. Taurus's energy. Yang. Okay, they have a lot of passion for you. This person, a lot of burning passion. They want a great new beginning with you. This, there is, this person is your opposite. They're going to bring a lot of excitement in your life, a lot of fun. They love you. They have that passion. You're a treasure island to this person. They keep you close to their heart. This person kept you very close to their heart. Okay? They never let you go, you know, concerning you mentally and, you know, heart. 
wise, you know. This person has a lot of emotions for you. Okay, um, there's a question why here. Um, because this person was your backbone, or maybe this person. Yeah, this is somebody, somebody that's gonna have your back, or they had your back through hard times, or or you had their back through hard times. That's why they feel the way they feel about you. Because you were always there for that person. You were their backbone. You know, they may you may have took care of them. They were maybe in a situation where they had to be codependent on you at one time and you held them up. You are like their lucky star, the fates. And that's why they hold on to you. Look at this person holding on to you. It's like they're never going to let you go. Gemini energy could be here. Yeah, they're never going to let you go. Aquarius energy. Yeah, to the sea. And they're patiently waiting on you. This person's been waiting patiently to be with you. Um, or they're going to wait. They're not going to let you go. They're still going to hold on to you. They're going to wait patiently for you if you don't open up until you can open up for them. Okay? To give them another chance. To give them a new beginning. Okay? All right, so that's what I have for you, um, Taurus. Like, share, hit the notification button to be notified when I post a video. I love you guys. I hope I gave you guys some clarity on some things. Be good. And I'm out. Have a great week ahead.